want Spider-Man! Dude, we gotta talk about this. Hey, what is up, YouTube? First off, I know, the hair. I had a haircut. I actually like it because it's not in my eyes anymore. So anyway, uh, today we have just amazing, amazing Spider-Man news and just... We got news about Tom Holland, we got news about Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield, and Venom. All for Secret Wars, courtesy of Mikey Sutton. He is a huge Spider-Man news leaker. He's actually in tight with Marvel, and he was the one who had rumors and confirmations about Spider-Man being in Captain America Civil War. He was. He said stuff about Far From Home that we didn't know about before the movie came out. It happened. So, I mean... This is just insane, and it's all happening in Secret Wars. So we do have a little bit to wait, but, I mean, come on. This is going to be so, so awesome. So let's dive right into this news. All right, so Mikey says that Tom, Toby, and Andrew are going to reunite again, but with a plot twist. The fact that and the MCU can use Venom for one Film, not Sony, the MCU. And this confirms exactly what happened in the comic book story arc when in The Secret Wars, Spider-Man had the black Venom suit. And that's exactly what's going to happen. Spider-Man is going to have the rage. He's going to have the anger, the anxiety, all that sort of thing. Because he's lost Aunt May. He's basically lost MJ, he's basically lost Ned, he lost everything and everyone he cared about, all because he had to save the multiverse, and now with the Venom symbiote coming in, that rage is going to be exacting. I mean, basically what I'm just trying to say is, he is going to be all out, it's like that one scene from No Way Home when he almost took the shot on the Green Goblin, but Toby stopped him. Well, I actually think that that was foreshadowing to what's going to happen. Now, in that scene when the Green Goblin was about to die, Toby stopped Tom because he knew that killing the Green Goblin wasn't going to do anything. It wasn't going to bring Aunt May back. It was just an exact of revenge. Well, something insane that is going to happen is Tom is going to have the Venom suit. And Toby, for one, knows what that feels like. The, the poison, the anger, the rage, everything. And... It has been confirmed, I mean, plot twist, we can only see one way out of this. Toby and Andrew are going to have to fight Tom. I mean, this is just insane, because I actually feel like this is a good idea due to the fact that Spider-Man 3 with Spider-Man vs. Venom didn't do so well, but now this can be redeemed through Toby and Andrew fighting Tom. I mean, this is just... Crazy insane. This news has been confirmed through Mikey. He's reliable. And it is just insane to see and know that this is going to happen in Secret Wars. But what's even more insane is the fact that it has also been confirmed through Mikey that Andrew Garfield and Tobey Maguire are going to be fighting alongside with the Avengers in the Secret Wars. I mean, this is just <laughs> crazy. Especially... Due to the fact that before No Way Home, Andrew and Toby didn't know anything about the Avengers. But, I mean, now that we're getting Andrew and Toby with the Avengers, I feel like it's going to be like that one scene with um, the Guardians of the Galaxy and Iron Man in Avengers Infinity War. Like, you know this guy? Uh, something like that with Tom Holland uh, and Andrew Garfield and Toby Maguire are going to be like, Oh, you guys must be those Avengers! that Tom was talking about or something like that. If you recall why Toby and Andrew don't remember the Avengers, it's because their universes don't have the Avengers. I mean, Toby Maguire has Doctor Strange, but they don't have Iron Man, Captain America, the Hulk, Thor, any of those guys. So it's just going to be insane not only to see two Spider-Man teaming up with the Avengers, but... The Avengers fighting Spider-Man villains. I mean, this could just be insane. I mean, Venom, the Green Goblin, Doctor Octopus, Electro, Kraven the Hunter, all these characters insane. And that combined with the fact that 
Spider-Man Spider-Tangle is basically a web to each and every single individual Spider-Man variant in the multiverse. Like, their senses are all shared to each other, similar to what happened in um, Into the Spider-Verse, when two variants of Spider-Man were at close proximity with each other, their spider sense, like, went haywire to tell themselves, this guy is like me. So, Spider-Man, I'm just gonna say, is gonna be one of the most important variants in Secret Wars. Now, when it comes to the Kang Dynasty, I don't know whether or not Tom Holland will be in that, but who knows, maybe Toby and Andrew will. But, I mean, this is all just crazy to think about. So again, a lot to take in in such little time. So, this is all just crazy. The fact that they're finally gonna have Venom in the MCU. I mean, wow. Holy cow, I am stoked for Secret Wars. I mean, I wasn't sure about it at first because, you know, that whole Russo brothers directing it, but they're confirmed to not be directing it, so not all of the variants are gonna die, so. <laughs> all right, so I hope you guys have enjoyed this news. Make sure to comment down below what the Dragon Man family subscribers should be named, and make sure to subscribe so you can enter that contest. Whichever name gets the most hits wins. Share with this video with your friends, and give this video a like. Also, Huge, huge announcement to make. I am getting closer and closer to 10 subscribers. And with that, after we get 10 subscribers, I'm going to have a giveaway. I'm going to draw you guys a comic book poster for anything. Like, it's going to be a comic book version of you next to your favorite character. It could be Marvel, it could be Star Wars, Transformers, Sonic the Hedgehog, anything from the Cinematic 7. DC, Alice in Wonderland, How to Train Your Dragon, anything. Like, literally. It will turn out something like this. Only it will be you next to your favorite character and or characters. So make sure to leave a comment down below this video on what your favorite movie from the Cinematic 7 is, who are your favorite characters, and... I will be picking a winner as soon as we get 10 subscribers. So, I respect all you movie nerds out there. Peace out. Let the fun begin.